Well, we have another warm day today, not quite 80 degrees, but a cold front is on the way. We'll touch off a few showers, mostly to our north, but another chance of rain Thursday could be more hopeful. So yesterday's high temperature, a ridiculous 85 degrees in the Twin Cities. Uh, the whole southern half of the state uh, into the 80s yesterday, pretty incredible. Only five other times have we had uh, consecutive 80s this late in the season. So this is a pretty rare warmth for us. Cold front is on our doorstep though, already in northwestern Minnesota, touching off some light rain showers. Uh, and this is mostly gonna be another northern Minnesota event. Uh, just about the northern third of the state will see some measurable rainfall. Uh, farther south, just maybe a brief sprinkle or two. We will notice the wind shift though this evening. Winds will pick up uh, and switch out of the northwest by about 7, 8 o'clock or so. It's going to be a windy overnight as that cooler air moves in. And tomorrow will feel chilly because it's actually going to be normal for a change, something we haven't seen much of. But ahead of that front, mid-70s still today. But notice the contrast, 50s in the northwestern corner of the state. That's the cooler air moving in. Uh, and as I mentioned, here are those showers mostly to the north. But uh, we might see a brief sprinkle in the overnight. And importantly, too, notice to the north where that colder air really sets in, could even see some snow showers briefly early tomorrow morning uh, as that moisture exits the area. But for the most part, we should see the sunshine break back out tomorrow. Uh, but uh, rainfall, as I mentioned, confined to the northern part of the state, but some spots could see a quarter to as much as a half inch near the international border. It's something, but you can see that really as we get south, probably a, 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 a measurable rainfall, unlikely. Mid 50s for t highs tomorrow, mid to upper 50s, 40s to the north. Those are normal temperatures, but again, that's been pretty rare so far this month, so it will feel chilly. Uh, and then the next cool front Thursday, will touch off more rain showers. So it'll be briefly warmer again Thursday, back in the 60s, but some showers late in the day possible. And right now, many of the models are giving us a measurable rainfall. It'd be the first one since September 19th if we can do it. Not gonna be much, maybe a tenth of an inch or so, uh, but it's something, it's better than these last few rain chances that have done nothing as far as measurable rain. Uh, and then we'll cool off again Friday, Saturday, but we could be back up to very warm readings again early next week. This is Tuesday, the 29th of October, could be near 80 again, according to the Canadian model, and most of the other models have us into the 70s, but we could also be into a more active pattern next week. These are looking at uh, precipitation total plumes over the next two weeks, and most of the models do see an increase, uh, maybe one to three inches of rainfall in that late next week into November period. If that happens, that would be very uh, helpful to us, but I'm a little skeptical as it's been very difficult to get any systems to, to really deliver here. 75 today, winds shift late in the day, maybe a sprinkle this evening into the overnight, and then back into sun tomorrow for southern Minnesota. Cooler, breezy, 57. Uh, 66 Thursday is back above normal by 13 degrees. And again, that next cool front could touch off a more widespread rain chance for us in central and southern Minnesota with showers later in the day. Friday and Saturday will be cooler again, back to more October-like temperatures before things are warming back up into early next week again.